hey check this out we're going to um, create a pipe network and in a previous video we've generated a pipe catalog and we did that by going to modify and uh, pipe network and uh, you know created a parts list uh, or a pipe catalog from the pipe catalog so um, with that we are going to go to the home ribbon and go to pipe networks and create uh, pipe network creation tools and we get this dialog that shows up and we can give it a name you can give it a specific name if you have a particular run that you want to do for a, um, for a project but I'm going to leave it as network and it'll just give it an auto number and uh, this is the parts list that we generated and uh, I'm going to pick the storm sewer and you can pick a surface. Now the surface is going to be used in setting rim elevations. So I'm just going to pick EG for, for this example, which is this surface right here. Um, you could also pick an alignment. I'm going to say none. You don't need an alignment um, for, your, uh, for your pipe network. The other thing to consider is the, uh, the label styles. Now, in this dialog, when you're doing this create pipe network, these styles pertain to the plan view. So you have plan view and you have profile view. These pertain to the plan view. So I'm just going to go through and pick some plan view stuff that uh, that I use uh, typically. Um, you could get into generating some specific styles the way that you like to see information portrayed in your plan view. So I'm going to say OK and then this dialogue shows up and it's basically saying that we are working on the network and this is what we named it, it was network and it auto generated a five um, so I have additional networks in here just in practice for this presentation but what is what we need to look at is if you go from left to right you'll look at this button which is your pipe network properties you click on that and it kinda goes through um, a bunch of information that's being applied when you're generating um, your pipe network. One is this is your network name. You could change it here if you needed to. Um, the other is your layout settings, and this is all your plan view stuff that we set up at the front end, and your exist, you know, your surface that kind of thing. And then you need to pay particular attention to your profile. Right now these are set to none and the problem with that is that we want when we bring these parts into our profile to be labeled properly. So what we're going to do is we're going to set the label style for the profile view for structures and um, pipes and profile. So the other thing with this too is that I'm see I'm picking this pipe with pro, uh, with uh, pipe profile. There's another one that's storm crossing which will give you your ellipses and that kind of thing when, when things are um, crossing in profile view but uh, for this example I'm going to simply say that. Um, there's also section you know how, how your, your stuff is uh, gonna look in section view but I'm gonna say okay then going f again from left to right we have the uh, select the surface which we already did here but you could also pick it here you could pick your alignment and this is your parts catalog your uh, your parts list and right now I'm set to storm but you could change it while you're designing you could change it say okay and these are your parts so you've got your structures and you have your pipes and this is all coming out of your parts list and I simply created this uh, the C dot from um, my list and I'm gonna say I want uh, I'm gonna go with HDP and I'm going to say 18 inch so with that we can set this is where you start building you set either your pipes and structures at the same time so as you pick you're setting a structure and then it stretches a pipe between them using these parts um, keeping in mind that you could change these parts if you want to but you can only change them by gripping your plan view part not your profile view part um, or you could just do a pipe like say, say you had a, a, a road crossing and it was just a culvert and you didn't have uh, you know structures on either end you could simply just say you know put a pipe uh, that you could also just set structures uh, 
if in building your network you were um, setting structures and you weren't sure how they were going to connect or um, whatnot. So you can you can connect parts later. But for this exercise, we're just going to do pipes and structures. And then if you notice down in your command line, you have specify the structure insertion point. So I'm just going to go ahead and pick in in my plan view here. So I pick one, it set a structure, and then I'm going to go ahead and pick another spot here. And I'm going to, do I have ortho one? I sure do, look at that. And then um, pick one over here and one over here. So what's happening is is that it doesn't know what station to put based on my, my label style because I don't have an alignment um, attached with this uh, pipe network. But it's picking up the rim from the surface. So um, I press enter because I'm done. And now my pipe network is generated. So when I have a profile for this alignment, I can simply project these parts if I uh, if I grip on the uh, the profile, it'll give me up in my contextual ribbon, uh, you know, project parts into profile, and it will project those in there. Now, if I wanted to edit this, I simply grip on it, my ribbon changes, and I can um, edit my pipe network through this, or I can um, look through. Uh, where's the uh, pipe network basically what you can do is you can pick this and you can edit all of your your uh, pipe information meaning inverts and that kind of thing um, or your structure information you can change your rims you could change um, you know how they are uh, being affected you know some descriptions that kind of thing and uh, do some edits from that perspective. You could also, if you wanted to edit this pipe, do a right click after you grip it and go to pipe properties and that brings up some information for this pipe. So you could change slopes of pipe you know based on the start in, you know your start invert uh, elevation say I want to go at whatever percent and you can start building um, your pipe network uh, with those tools. So uh, I'll uh, see you next time.